Hey everyone, Michael Garber here, and I wanted to show you a cool little feature I just discovered in FCP 10.1. This may have been around in previous versions, but it's something I didn't know about and I wanted to share. Uh, I could have written it up in a post, but it was just easier for me to do a quick screen recording. So what it is, is a way to, when you're, when you are trimming, or what, sorry, when you are slipping clips in FCP, uh, if the audio is expanded as it is here, and you trim, it moves the audio with it. It creates an L or a J cut, which has applications. But the only way to avoid that that I know of is to select the clip and uh, make sure that the clip is collapsed. And then you can slip the clip uh, with the audio intact and, and it keeps your in and outs. So let me undo that. So if your clip, if you're doing a lot of editing and sometimes you're like, okay, there's my, oh shoot, I don't want to have to undo that. And let's say I didn't want a J or an L cut and I don't want to have to undo it. So there's a key command that will allow you to, un to fix the audio. And if you go up to, well, first you have to hit C to select the clip. You go up to the clip menu, clear audio video split, which I've mapped to option C. And it expands and trims the head and tail of the audio, which is very cool. So basically, if I'm editing along here and I didn't realize that this was expanded and I wanted to move that to there and I go, oh, shoot, that's not what I wanted. I can just quickly hit C, option C, and it brings it back and uh, the in and out point of the video remain intact. So quick little tip, hope that's something that can help you while you're working.